Today's video was brought to you by the Abbey Community School Society. Hello everyone and welcome back to your virtual art class. My name is Sarah and I'm your instructor for this video series. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys a cool project that you can do just by taking pictures of things around your house. So without further ado, let's get started on today's video. Composition is the arrangement or placement of visual elements in a piece of artwork. In today's video, I'm going to put your compositional skills to the test through a series of art challenges where you'll use your artistic instincts to create two amazing art pieces. The supplies are simple. All you need is something to take pictures with and your own house. You can use any camera for this project, but all of my instructions will be related to using my iPhone, so you may have to adjust some of the steps if you're using something different. In the first challenge, we'll be creating a piece of video art, in which photographs from your home will be shown quickly in the same composition. The challenge is, every item that you photograph must be shaped like a circle. Before you start taking pictures, one adjustment that I made to my phone was I turned on the grid feature in my camera app. This way, when I'm taking pictures, I can ensure that the center of each circle will line up with the center of my photo. I also turned my camera on the square photo mode. All right, you guys, so the first and pretty much the only step in this project is just to go around your house and find things that are shaped like a circle. A really good place to start is your kitchen. Maybe open your kitchen cupboard. There's mugs and glasses that are shaped like circles. Pay close attention to the details that surround you, and you might just be surprised how many circles you can find. Once you feel like you've taken enough photos, it's time to get to editing. I took a little over 60, but you can take as few or as many as you'd like. There's a free app called InShot Video Editor that you can download and use on your iPhone or Android, and that will help us get this done easily and quickly. Once you've downloaded the app, you can open it and click the Create New Video button on the left side of the screen. After allowing the app to access your camera roll, you can select all of the photos you just took and then press the green check mark button on the right to import them into the project. After a brief loading period, you'll be able to edit your video. All that we need to do is shorten the length of each clip so that the slideshow quickly switches between each photo. To edit the duration of each clip, slide the bar above your photos to the left to reveal the button. Click the duration button and then use the slider to adjust the length of your clip. I would recommend keeping it short, at 0.2 seconds per clip. To copy this adjustment to all of them, click the double check mark button on the left. Now your video is ready to export. You can click the arrow button in the top right hand corner, and to increase the quality of your video, you can change the resolution to 1080p. Then click the save button, and your video will be added to your camera roll. Here's how mine turned out. This is just one example of how everyday objects in your house can be turned into art. For our second challenge, we'll be using our photography and compositional skills again. Your goal for this project will be to create an arrangement of objects from around your house and take a picture of it. The challenge is, every object you choose has to be the same color. For my arrangement, I took one look around my house and saw that a few items were popping out to me, all in the color red. Once you've collected all of your items, find a flat surface to create your arrangement. Place the items down in a way that looks pleasing to the eye and keep adjusting until you think it looks good. When you're ready, you can take a picture of it. Here's how mine turned out. What we can 
can learn from both of these projects is that you can literally make art out of anything. By employing some basic artistic principles and getting creative with the things in your own home, you can create some pretty cool projects. Thank you guys so much for tuning into today's video. I can't wait to see all the amazing projects that you guys are going to create. And as always, if you have any questions at all about this project, please feel free to reach out to me. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!